Hello everybody, this is Joanna here. Uh, I am video blogging. Wow, crazy, right? I know I've never done this before, so this is a bit weird for me, but I figure, you know, I'm gonna be stuck in this place uh, editing for a lot of this summer, so I thought I'd maybe like sit down in front of the camera and sort of update you from time to time on what was going on and, and what I'm working on, because I know you guys are probably waiting for a lot of the stuff that I'm working on right now. So, here we go, okay. Standard Action Season 3, right, okay, well that's the most, uh, that's the biggest one uh, for me right now for sure, I'm sure a lot of you guys out there are waiting for it. There is a three-person post-production team on Standard Action Season 3, it is coming along very well, it's looking gorgeous, I know I have to say that because I'm the producer and all that, but it does look gorgeous, I am really excited about Season 3, there's a lot of great stuff in it, a lot of really interesting, a lot of new stuff in it, uh, yeah, it's, um, yeah, it's very exciting, <laughs> and we are plugging away. For sure. Uh, I'm going to be doing the, the layout. I am doing the layout editing and that kind of thing. And then I'm passing it off to Rob Hunt, who's our director and our post-production lead, to sort of polish it up and do the mastering and the color correction and the visual effects. And then we have Kirsten Tennert, who's our composer, who's going to be doing the sound design and the composing and all of that sort of fun stuff. Right, so that is coming along. If you want to keep up on Standard Action, I do keep the Facebook page pretty busy and the Twitter feed pretty busy. Uh, on Facebook you can find us at Standard Action, and at Twitter you can find us at standard action except the standard doesn't have any vowels uh yeah don't make me spell it i'm gonna put it here like on the screen something here okay um and yeah you can uh go over to our website standardaction.com uh which will have a whole lot of nice little updates on there as well we try and keep it pretty active we just want to let you know that we are definitely working we are not sitting on our asses we are we are doing stuff we're making sure things are happening uh, and and we'd love to talk to you at any point if you want to reach out and ask questions about how things are going for sure feel free to do so also some really interesting news some really fun news for standard action that came out just recently um Sandeep Parikh, who you will know from the Guild, as well as from The Legend of Neil, uh, and guest starring on a whole lot of other really awesome web series like Fresh Hell and My Gimpy Life and that kind of thing, uh, is guest starring on Standard Action for Season 3. Kind of a last minute thing, uh, we got him involved and he was incredibly good to work with, really fun, an actor with real integrity, uh, it's going to be really good. Okay, next thing, Starlet Citadel. So Starlet Citadel Board Game Reviews is a board game review show that has, I don't know how many episodes at this point, lots, like a hundred maybe? They're in their third season, we're in our third season, and uh, I host it along with Kaya Sadowski, who is the manager of Starlet Citadel, the shop in town, the, uh, the board game retailer. So they don't actually have like a, a storefront, so instead we make these reviews so they can gather a community and talk to people out there and, and create a relationship with uh, their buyers and their fans. So now, in the third season, I am actually taking on the post-production and the directing for that, which is very exciting and a really steep learning curve for me and a lot of fun. So if you go back and you look at sort of the earlier episodes and then you look at the really recent ones, me with short hair in them, you'll see a different style of shooting. Uh, because we have a different DOP, uh, Carla Miller, who is one of our camera ops for Standard Action, is now DOPing Starlet Citadel, which is very cool. Uh, and it's also got a little bit of different stuff in it. I tried a new intro with some stop motion. Ooh, stop motion, very exciting. Uh, and yeah, it's uh, it's different and it's cool. And I hope you like it. Uh, let me know. Um, I'm learning a lot right now and it's a lot of fun. What else? Okay, well last night, I think it was last night, I hope I launched this video today, <laughs> um, was Caustic Soda Podcast live show. If you guys don't know Caustic Soda Podcast, you should check them out. They are in their fourth or fifth season at this point. Caustic Soda is a podcast that talks about really horrible stuff usually, like really gross things and really interesting sort of scientific things and... Yeah, they usually really try to offend their listeners, <laughs> but they do it in a really funny, funny way. It's a, it's a really good time. And they did a live show called um, the Lesser of Two Evils Marathon, because one of the segments on their show is Lesser of Two Evils, where the guests have to choose between re two really, really horrible things that happen. Um, and it's usually really funny because you're discussing why you would pick one horrible thing over another. Anyway, we did a bunch of those on the live show last night. And there were a bunch of guest stars in there and I was one of them and it was uh, hilarious and you should be able to purchase this as a sort of downloadable content from their website which is causticsodapodcast.com I believe but if it isn't I'll put it on the screen here somewhere. Also another thing that uh, that I do regularly 
and I will do this month again, is The Critical Hit Show. The Critical Hit Show is a live D&D comedy that happens uh, at the Rio Theatre. It's improv every month, last Wednesday of the month, so it's going to happen, of course, the last Wednesday in May. It happened the last Wednesday in April, and we had an amazing guest star on for that. Uh, Billy Campbell came and played with us on stage. Billy Campbell is, if you don't know him, the Rocketeer. He's also on The Killing, and he's on Helix right now as well. So in the Critical Hit Show, Eric Fell, who is our DM, he, uh, he puts together crazy, bizarre, weird adventures for us. And then a bunch of improv comedians, really brilliant improv comedians, and then me, uh, go up on stage and play D&D basically on our feet. And there's a lot of, a lot of fun, a lot of improv. It's, uh, it's, it's very dirty. It's, <laughs> it's, it's definitely a 19 plus event, but for sure, come on out and enjoy it. It's, it's a lot of fun. What else? Well, I made a really good curry this week. Yeah, that's what kind of happens when you're stuck in your apartment editing a lot, is, uh, is you cook uh, when you want to take breaks from the editing. Um, and uh, yeah, yeah, curry's a really good choice. Yeah, because it lasts forever. You can make a really big pot of it, and it just gets better, because as it sits there, it like gets stronger and stuff. Oh, it's really tasty. Oh, I also wanted to show you the hair, right? Like. Isn't it awesome? I'm really excited about it. I know that a lot of you out there won't be excited about it, you won't like it at all, and you'll probably let me know that you don't like it at all, but that's okay, I don't mind, you can tell me it's fine, but I like it, and I'm gonna keep it this way for a little while, so just so you know, it's not, it's not changing, you gotta get used to this. 